The centurion was a Roman soldier responsible for between 80 and 100 soldiers. He was a Gentile, an instrument of Israel's oppression, a leader in the forces that maintained that oppression of Israel, the occupying force in Israel. He grew up knowing many gods he would have heard of and or been exposed to many healing rituals because he was from a country, from a culture that believed in or practiced polytheism. Several gods, many gods, gods of this, gods of that, gods of the other. Very different from a monotheistic Israel whose belief was there's one God. Beside him, there's no other. Yet, here comes this man. He was not a Jew. He was in Israel because he was there to help to manage the occupation of Israel by his country. All his life, he would have known of many gods. All his life, he would have known of various rituals for healing. Yet, now his servant, his slave, was ill, sick to the point of death. And he needed help for his slave. And he heard of Jesus. He heard of the miracles that Jesus wrought. He heard of the many healings that Jesus performed. And he decided that's where true help can be found. You see, it's important to know where your help comes from. The psalmist said in Psalm 121 verses 1 and 2, I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where does my help come? My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. It is important to know where your true help comes from. Where is your help coming from? My help comes from God. It does not matter what conduit is used. The source of my help is the Lord. My strength is from the Lord. Where does your help come from? It's important that we do not get distracted by all the other options and by the facades that are around. It's important that you know where to go when you need help. The centurion did not go to the gods that the Roman Empire were used to. He did not go to the rituals that he would have known growing up. He sought for Jesus. He sought for help from Jesus. He made his request known. And the scriptures tell us, ask and it shall be given unto you. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you. Be anxious for nothing. 
put in everything with prayer and supplication. With thanksgiving, make your requests known unto the Lord. The Lord hear thee in the day of trouble. The name of the God of Jacob defend thee. Send thee help from the sanctuary and strengthen you out of Zion. Our help comes from God. Know the source of your help. God bless you. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And for more, join us at 9 a.m. at 10 Union Square, Crossroads, Kingston, Jamaica. If you can't be there in person, join us virtually via YouTube Live.